Guys, Deluda Guna, YouTube's N'Golo Kante. You guys watch me for a reason because you know I do this. So yeah, let's get into it. Charlie Masunda, we know how good he is. 21, um, 21 in five days, so 20 years of age. He's at that pivotal age where he needs to play football. Long story short, Conte does like him. He recalled him last year um, to stay in amongst the first team after his loan spell. Um, Roma wanted him, etc. He said no. This year, he said he's a good player. He's been training at centre half and um, centre half, central midfield and right back for his chance. And it is, it might, it looked like it was like it was gonna come, like it was gonna come. But the real reason for this vid is because he was very frustrated. He made an Instagram post. Now, allegedly, he's in contract talk, so it could be about that. It could be about the playing time. It is a, it is a lot. Go and check it out. I'm not gonna bring out the quotes and things, but he, it sounded like someone that is frustrated. He said he tries hard and hard and hard and hard, and he, it's important to know. He said he's gonna keep trying. But he's been working his ass off, working his ass off, working his butt off, and he's not anywhere near to the first team. Can you blame him for someone that was linked with all this potential that Hazard um, talks up, that he's batted up youth sides and Bet Betis, it was so-so, but he's shown his quality. He's only played three times since signing in 2012 from Anderlecht or wherever he came from for Chelsea. And with his contract up in 2019, and they obviously want to renew his deal, can you blame him for being frustrated? No, you can't. Three appearances. One, once, I don't know. I think once is 90 minutes against Boris. Uh, he might have even been subbed in that. So I don't know. You can't blame him. His, 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 his brother, one of his brothers, also took shots at Chelsea. He started saying they wouldn't know if Messi or Ronaldo was in their academy. I don't think he was talking personally about Masunda being one of them, but in the sense that Chelsea don't look at their academy and they could have someone of immense quality and not bring him through. You, he is clearly someone going to the top. JD and all these brands always getting him to do meet and greets. He speaks like a star on his socials. You'd think he's already there. That's nothing against him. He, he, he just looks like someone that's ready for the big time. I like him a lot. He's got technical quality. He probably needs to bulk up a bit. Technical quality, good movement and things like that. I like him. His contract's up in 2019, so he has a lot to think about. Like Conte does say he likes him, and I previously just said in, in the beginning of this vid why he likes him, but he also has stuff to be worried about. He's, you've seen Conte said a lot of things about young players are not patient enough, they're not this, they're not that, they're deferred, and his record at Chelsea hasn't been that well. I'm actually upset that Bogger went on loan to, to, to Birmingham, to be honest. It was a good bit of deal from the wheel and dealer Harry, Kay, um, Harry Kane, Harry Redknapp, but... I believe Mas um, Masanda Boga should be playing in the champ in the in the Premier League or or he could have stayed in France. I'd rather play in the France top league than against the likes of PSG and and Monaco than then play against Derby and things like that. And especially when he especially was it against us, he got his chance and and he was playing all right in pre season. And then unfortunately Cahill like an idiot got sent off and his time was out. But yeah, man, like I think Masanda. If I was him, I'd see how this season goes. Maybe ask for a loan in January if I'm not getting games, and then ultimately depart the club at, in the in in the summer. To be honest with you, because for all your talent, you need a look in, and ultimately you need to play games. Like I said, he's 21 in five days. He'll, this time next year, he'll be 22. 23 is really when you got to start ascend, um, asserting yourself as a player. There's all this potential, and I believe he can hit it, but he needs to ultimately play to prove it. He can play on the left, he can play on the right, he can play centre mid, he can play deeper. He's been training in a full-back position at, position at one point, so he's ready to just start playing, to be honest. But I can't blame him. If you look, as much as I want him to do it, it, it does look like a loser's game. Three times since signing in 2012, That's five. that was five years ago. You see Baker depart on loan, Izzy Brown, Casey Palmer, Chelobo go permanently, Ruben Loftus-Cheek. All of these players, Mount, obviously it's a bit early for Mount, but Mount's gone on loan. All of these talented players that are not really getting a look in. So you can't really be confident for him. Talent always shines. Maybe with a couple injuries, he might get a look in. But yeah, to be honest, I, I, I can't blame him for being angry. He also, it's important to also mention, he said he's still going to apply the same work rate, effort and things like that. So you can't blame him, man. I mean, it's got. It, I, I actually understand this frustration because you ultimately want to play. He took his chance against Forrest and he played well. He's been on the bench a couple of times, but ultimately you want to play games. And there was probably offers to go out on loan and maybe Conte said you'd play games or maybe he said he'd want to stay. I don't know. It's, that's neither here nor there. But guys, Deluda Guna, I'm signing out. Just thought I'd give you a little heads up as to what's going on go and check out the man's post or go on um, daily mail or, or sky sports or anywhere to be honest in fact forget daily mail i don't know why i'm plugging them i hate them oh, on any non nonsense news station go and look at my Saunders, what he said or go on his actual instagram but guys delaying exiting this deluded guna i'm signing out get in the comments i'm out